Hallelujah, hallelujah, saints of God. Listeners, we love you so much. Hallelujah. Welcome to Fresh Man. I am your humble host, Pastor Arthur. You call me Pastor A. We love you here at Arthur Morris Ministries. First, we will always give honor and our love towards our Heavenly Father. Father, you're so awesome and excellent. Hallelujah, the Holy Trinity. Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Father, you're so excellent. We love you so very much. Oh, we just thank you so, so, so much. Thank you for your love and your kindness towards us. We we don't give enough of your love and your grace and your mercy. Thank you for, for loving us. Thank you for your, your servanthood. Thank you for serving us as we serve you. Thank you because you're the God of the universe. You're the Father. <laughs> Hallelujah. But you, you see fit to love on us. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. We love you so very much. Holy Lord Jesus, we love you so much, Elder Brother. Thank you for being our Messiah. Thank you for being our Christ. Thank you for being our Savior. Thank you for your precious blood was spilled at Calvary. We thank you so much for dying in our place, saving us by your grace, your love, your kindness. Thank you, Holy Spirit, speaking through us with the tongue of the learned. We love you so very much. God us to all truth, wisdom, revelation. Thank you for your love. Hallelujah, Holy Trinity, thank you for your love as a whole. Thank you for making us. Thank you for creating us. Thank you for taking time out to love us. We love you so very much, Holy Spirit. Lord Jesus, we love you. Father God, we love you. Father, we love you. Lord Jesus, we love you. Holy Ghost, we love you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen and amen. We love you. We love you. We love you. And all the Mars Ministries. Thank you, listeners, for all that you do. Thank you for all your support. We don't take it lightly. We salute you. We honor you. Thank you for all your letters that you mail, all your emails, all the prayer requests. We don't take it lightly. We just thank God for your life. Thank you. We thank you. Hallelujah. We praise God for your life. Thank you. We honor God. We honor you. Hallelujah. The Bible says give honor where honor is due. Hallelujah. And you guys that um follow us and with our with our ministry and, and partner with our ministry we just we just love on you hallelujah we don't want to give you nothing else but god's love and we want to always convey that to you god's love um towards him and his people hallelujah we we thank god for you hallelujah <laughs> you're precious to god and you're precious to us so we're going to jump right into another beautiful scripture at, Fresh manna, hallelujah, all the Mars ministries, we love you so very much. Oh, we're coming from the beautiful book of Hebrews, chapter 13, verse 4. The, the beautiful book of Hebrews, chapter 13, verse 4. I love this scripture right here. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Whew, thank you, Jesus. And the beautiful word of God states, Marriage is honorable among all, and the bed undefiled, but fornications, or fornicators, excuse me, and adulterers, God will judge. I say again, marriage is honorable among all and the bed undefiled. But fornicators and adulterers, God will judge. Hallelujah. That's been a precious reading of Hebrews chapter 13, verse 4. Hallelujah. Mm -mm -mm. Let's read. Let's read. Hallelujah. What the, what the study Bible says about this. Hallelujah. It says, honorable. God highly honors marriage which he instituted at creation. That's Genesis 2 and 24. But some people in the early church considered celibacy to be holier than marriage. An idea Paul strongly denounces in 1 Timothy 4 and 3. Hallelujah. Sexual activity in a marriage is pure. But any sexual activity outside marriage brings one under divine judgment. God will judge. God prescribes serious consequences for sexual immorality. Hallelujah. That's real. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's very real. Um it's very real. God is so awesome. We have to really um revert back to God's word. That's why we do fresh manna. We always give honor um to God and his holy word. His word is precious. We always got to go back to our mirror. We have to go back to where we came from. And God is our essence. God is our strength. He is our everything. We got to go back to what the father said at the beginning and how he created the forefathers, uh, Adam and Eve. Hallelujah. He created them to already 
when he took the rib out of Adam, they were already married. Hallelujah. I say again, once God took the rib out of her, I mean, out of him, Adam, they were already married. Y'all already, it was already sacred. It was already perfect then. Hallelujah. So they was in unison already. Hallelujah. So what that said is the solution to um, the marriage um, of being together and, and doing it the right way of, of the sexual contact of the beer being undefiled. You got to bring it back to our roots. When Adam and Eve conceived their baby or when they first had sexual um, intercourse, it was it was holy. Hallelujah. Because they was married. Don't ever, ever think, don't get in the lust, because I've been there, hallelujah, before before I was married. Um, you can't get into that lust, and you can, you can fall so deep into it that you think, you know it's wrong. But see, when you're dealing with lust and you're dealing with that, that flesh, the flesh gets comfortable in that, in that bad stuff, so in that lust. So God got something for you. The Bible speaks about you don't only sin against God, but you sin against your own body when you're dealing with sexual immorality. That God takes that very serious. You're playing with fire. Like the old folks say, you're really playing with fire when you're dealing with lust. You're playing with fire. You're masturbating. you you fornicating. You can't make it home. Hallelujah. I say again, you can't make it home. Because then is I love that stuff more than God. It's no Hallelujah. The Bible speaks about uh, being married instead of burning. Hallelujah. You wait on God. You see God's face. God brings somebody beautiful in your life. You do right by that person. First of all, you do right by God and you do right by that person by remaining pure. And then y'all, y'all, you know, y'all get it on. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, when you get married and that's a beautiful thing. God created marriage for us so we can know union, so we can know unison. Like the Bible describes marriage being in, being an example of how Jesus loved the church by giving himself, you know, to the church. Hallelujah. So awesome. So that's how it's supposed to be for that man and that woman. Um, the man giving himself, you know, to that to the woman being able to, you know, sacrifice and um love her like Jesus loved the church. Hallelujah. So it's a beautiful marriage. Marriage is so so awesome. It's so it's so complicated at times. That's why you have to depend on God. Um it's so simple at times. It's so complex. I want to say it's just life growing growing with um someone that God bless you with. So beautiful, so kind, so sweet, so merciful, so loving, so kind. Um, and you know, it's a beautiful thing. We'll, we'll go on and on about more about marriage and me and my wife's, um, teachings on marriage. Hallelujah. We've been married, um, for a decade now, but we've been together, um, longer than a decade. So it's a beautiful thing. We got a lot of wisdom in that area. Bless God through the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. And we'll be doing segments together. Hallelujah. To impact and help other couples out there to you know to hold on to to hang in there to love each other to grow together i mean it's a must i just thank god that's one of the greatest highlights one of the greatest highlights of my life is knowing christ jesus knowing the father the holy spirit knowing the holy trinity and um having my beautiful wife hallelujah and having my i say again having my beautiful wife at my side with me as I do all the Morris ministries, as we serve in the ministry together, both of us pastors, both of us ministers of the gospel, both of us are called to be prophets also. We, we got the prophetic gift also. So hallelujah. It's just, it's a beautiful thing when you're actually equally yoked with somebody and they, they have the same vision as you. Hallelujah. They have the same goals. They have the same heart out to God like you. So I leave you with that. It's a beautiful thing. You you wanna is is honorable. Hallelujah. It's an honorable thing to God when you marry. Because God loves marriage. Hallelujah. What well, what God brings together, let no man take apart. Hallelujah. You I'm telling you. That's that's beautiful. I can't wait uh for me and my wife to get together and and, and bring more teachings 
to the body of Christ, more teachings to you guys. And, and oh my God, yeah, it's so honorable to God. And I honor it. I honor my marriage so much. I thank God for my marriage so much, people of God. I'm telling you, you're hearing the Holy Ghost right now from the depths of my soul. I honor my marriage so, 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 so. So, 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 so much. Hallelujah. It's, it's not a game when I talk about marriage. It's not a game. Very passionate because it, it got honor it and I don't take it lightly. And your kids is another thing. That's a whole nother beast. Hallelujah. <laughs> but we'll be speaking about that also. But uh, we love you here in Arthur Morris Ministry. We thank you for your listening in. Hallelujah. Thank you for your precious seeds. If you want to sow into our ministry, we always extend the opportunity for you guys to sow. Hallelujah. At the Blessed website. Hallelujah. At com. I say again, com. Hallelujah. We salute you. We praise God for you. Thank you for your awesome prayers and your prayer requests. Hit us up at Facebook inbox us so we can decree and declare over your life. Hallelujah. Come in agreements with your prayer. Get it all for our Lord, Savior, Jesus Christ. Do whatever we have to do. Oh, man. For the Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So beautiful, saints. Listeners, we love you. Hallelujah. We love you so very much. God bless you.